Welcome. This is Brenda Harris greeting you in the precious name of Jesus. Thank you for stopping by today. I just wanted to let you know that a couple of weeks back I had a dream about this beautiful bridge. It was just absolutely beautiful. I was looking at it and wondering, oh, how unique this bridge is because the wood on it was not cut with a saw and made flat like you usually see bridges. This bridge was made out of the tree trunk without it being cut up, but they were real small tree trunks. And the first dream I had a couple of weeks ago was this blue bridge and it was all shiny and I got to looking at that and I thought I think that's a little kids bridge well then last night I had another dream and this dream was of another bridge like that other bridge I dreamed of, only this time it was a different color. It was more like a cedar color, but it was all varnished so shiny. It just really looked nice. And like the first bridge, it did not have a saw cut to it. It was just the tree trunks, but they were real little ones, you know. And I just thought how gorgeous these bridges were. And then I was thinking about that last night. And then I saw this flash of a flashlight. Now this flashlight was unique. It was white. But on the little rim of it, it was green. And then around this flashlight was some cellophane wrapping, but on the cellophane wrapping on the top of it, around the rim, was a pink color. So I thought to myself, now this flashlight is unique. I had never seen one like it. So I thought to myself, the colors on that flashlight makes me think that it would be a little kid's flashlight. So it finally dawned on me, well, I think God is telling me he wants me to do a video about children. So that's what I'm going to do. And, you know, God wants little children to shed their light among men. God doesn't want little children to put their light under a bushel. He tells the grown-ups not to put their light under a bushel. So I'm sure he feels the same way about little children. Because little children can tell others about the love of God as well. And also, God wants little children to be a bridge. A bridge of love between God and others. Because children very well have the capability of telling others about God. And Jesus said in the Bible, in his word, he said, Do not forbid the children to come unto me, for such is the kingdom of heaven. Why did Jesus say that? Because Jesus knows that little children have faith. And when you tell a child that God loves them, that Jesus loves them, they know. Most of them know that that's true, and they have the faith. And that's why Jesus said, for such is the kingdom of heaven. It's because a little child has faith. And now I would like to say a word about the children the Lord says I will pour out my spirit 
upon my little ones. They shall give me praise. Their voices shall give me praise. They will lift up their hands in honor to me, says God. And in these last days, I will use the children, even as I use the grown-ups and people of all ages, because I will pour my spirit out upon the children and people of all ages. This is the word of the Lord.